This is Doug Varnberg and welcome back to another set of tips and tricks and today we're here we got some exciting new stuff we got the new Gen 3 Mega Plus imaging unit from Humminbird. What Mega Plus does for you we've had the Mega imaging that megahertz frequency that showed super duper awesome details well we've just taken it another step what we've done those smart engineers down at Humminbird, those innovators have been able to take that range of that mega imaging and got farther out. Plus we have dual spectrum chirp now available in the 2D side. It's full chirp, 2D, down imaging, side imaging. What we're going to do is we're going to show you an introduction to the new Gen 3 Helix series unit with the Mega Plus awesome, amazing, super duper imaging available from Humminbird. The highest detailed imaging in the world for recreational sports fishermen. Let's jump in here and check it out. It's awesome. Now who's ready to see this awesome new Gen 3 unit from Humminbird? Comes with the Humminbird base map, but you can add a Lake Master card. I'm just gonna push it in and you're gonna be able to see the details of the Lake Master awesome mapping showing up. You can see here the added contours and all that stuff and the depth and range highlight that Lake Master created. You can actually come over here and if you come to the chart uh, Humminbird thing, you've got Auto Chart. And Auto Chart is going to allow you to create custom maps right here on the unit. And you'll see that we can create custom contour lines right here on our map, just like we've had before. Because you can make even more detailed mapping of your favorite little fishing areas. Or if you've got a place that isn't, isn't scanned, you can create your own. And that's the awesome part of Auto Chart Live. Available from Humberbird. You can create your own contours. You can see it right there developing on the map right in front of your eyes so if you got a little secret favorite fishing spot you can go in here and spend a lot more time and get some super high detail like humps and points and that type of stuff <coughs> you can learn it all we're just going to do a little spin real quick here to show you and we'll come to auto chart and we're going to flip it off here because we got to get into the more awesome data We've got lots of views. You got the mapping view, you got you got your mapping with your compass heading there. So if you're looking for a waypoint that makes it easier to get back on with your compass heading up here, there's true north right there, zero. Come in here, you got your bird's eye view. You got your bird, you got your comp split screen combo. I like this because you can have a big map and a little map. You got your mapping and your 2D sonar. Look at them fish. Ooh, we're going to get into some awesome goodies here. And uh, mapping in 2D, or down imaging. Mapping in side imaging. You got your, your 2D, your down imaging, and your mapping. You got your 2D, your map, your 2D, and your side imaging. You got your map, your down imaging, and your side imaging. And then this is your screenshot view. This is where if you hit your mark button, it'll save a picture of a screen capture. And now, dual spectrum chirp sonar. What that is, is it allows you to have full low Q chirp. We've got different display spectrums. I'm just gonna go over here to full. Full is like our combined son chirp. It's a combined chirp similar to what we had in our single frequency 283 kilohertz gives you that 20 and 60 degree coverage area all wrapped up in one screen and you can see out here look at them arches and look at them fish there's not a whole lot you can adjust here i mean you can take your sensitivity up if you want to increase it a little bit but if you start getting a little clutter just back it down look at them look at them trees and look at all this stuff that's out here look at that fish right there in the top of that tree and them other fish 
we'll hit uh, we'll jump back up here I'll show you why this is basically like that 60 degree coverage area of the 83 kilohertz that we're all used to but now it's in dual spectrum low Q chirp sonar and if you want to go to display and we'll go to to the to the narrow that reminds us of our 200 kilohertz that really high detailed 2d sonar data uh, look at them fish man look at that tree and you can see some fish actually in that tree in your 2d sonar data and here's some more fish showing up that is the new dual spectrum full chirp sonar from Humminbird. Now the next thing we're going to get into is our next button is our down imaging. Now we're coming out of the, we've got the dual spectrum chirp 2D sonar. Now let's look at down imaging. Wow, look at that tree there. Oh, that is mega plus down imaging sonar mega frequency chirp sonar and look at those details in the trees now we could tweak that a little bit come up here we'll go to our di enhance bring it down here you can increase your sensitivity but what you can do is you can help get rid of some of that clutter by using that contrast feature and make those tree branches really stick out now one of the things that brandon Pollinick got me on is changing to this color palette 4 gives you a lot more contrast and that is one of the things I'm going to show you here. We're going to come back up here to DI Enhance. And what he recommends and what I found out too, is you take that up there to about 14 to 16 and look at that tree pop. Wow, that is popping out. And then take your contrast and adjust it to get really good sharp data detail. About that same 14 to 16. Sometimes you need to increase the sensitivity a little bit but it's a good place to start to get that data you see that gets a little fuzzy there look at that tree boom look at that tree look right there Look at them trees. We got another one coming up here popping. You can pop it up a little bit. Look at the every branch is being shown. That is the Mega Plus awesome imaging from Humminbird. And look at the fish, man. You can see the fishies there. More fishies. This is some incredible stuff here. And it's from Humminbird. It's so simple, easy to operate. The highest detail and the easiest ease of operation. You can you can see we're coming up on a little point. We're a little hotter there. got a tree with fish in it right there got crappies I guarantee them are crappies go over here watch this hit your zoom key look at them fish right there and I seen some more right over here look at them fish sitting right there just hit your plus key and you can see them fish sitting right there off of that tree that's what mega plus imaging can do for you is help you find more fish so you can catch more fish now who's ready for mega plus side imaging we're at factory defaults here we got color palette 2 we've got our screen on 10 and 10 got it 10 and 10 one of the things with mega plus is the increased range and the increased detail we've got a lot of clutter so I, I mean this is probably some of the worst conditions to show how great this imaging is because of the clutter in the water column we've got a lot of 
coming you look at the water it's brown we got a lot of inflow mega imaging picks up those small microscopic product particles so it's not the most opportune time but we're going to give it to you anyway there's ways to tweak when you got this conditions and we'll go into that too now what i'm going to do is i'm going to tweak this to my favorite settings the color palette 4 we're going to go back up here to side imaging enhance we're going to start off at 16 on and you can see this big tree here and look at them fish get these gloves off man there's a fishy there 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 we're gonna just idle down through here but we're in 30 foot of water we've got mega plus on here we we're cranking the sensitivity and all these little white spots those are all fishies wow whoa whoa we look at that big beautiful tree look whoa now look at the detail in that look at all the tree branches wow look at that that is amazing detail that you're only going to get from mega plus imaging from hummingbird look at the the trees the details that's what it's all about seeing everything there's a fish there's a fish there's a fish there's a fish there jumping out at you now that is what mega plus imaging is all about is showing you the trees the details and being able to find those added details are going to help you catch fish there's nothing that's not going to be seen with hummingbird mega plus imaging now i mean you look at those those trees and you can see there's two more fish there what's really cool is when you put it all together your 2d and down imaging your your side imaging and your your mega side imaging and your 2d sonar now one of the things you can do like i've done here is split your position to get more you can go left or right that is awesome here to maximize that screen for that side imaging detail data that's so important to help you make better fishing decisions there's your zoom view of the bottom here is down imaging and side imaging side by side look at those tree branches wow you got the left side of side imaging the right side look at the rock detail down in here and look at that big old stump down there now you've got all three you've got your 2d your down image you look at that fish all this structured data you can put side imaging over the top of down image this is one of my favorite views because i can get a lot of down imaging data get that side imaging data all three of them side imaging on top you get that full screen so you get that good full width you got your down imaging here and then you're back to mapping there was a lot of packed in these hummingbird helix gen 3 units uh, it's amazing stuff you can we've had our auto chart on we can record off there but look at this this is what it's all about mega plus imaging giving you more showing you more but one of the cool things we've still got our historical great sonar and that stuff we come over we come over here to menu i can come right down here to my side imaging display if i want i've got 800 kilohertz it's a little hotter so i'm gonna have to turn it down i've also can go back here and i can do my 455 that man that has been the staple for years in shallow water you get big coverage areas mega plus is taking the place of this but there's still places and uses that the triple frequency difference of hummingbird amazing awesome units provide you we'll get back here to the to the most awesome stuff of mega plus because there's some cool stuff out here the details the data that's what it's all about if you want to increase your data look at that big old fishy right there but that's a big old catfish look at the tree data the fish in there so simple so easy it's hummingbird 
Now, isn't that cool? Mega Plus Imaging from Humminbird. See more, do more, and you get more in the total package. The Humminbird Mega Imaging Unit with all the features of Lake Master Mapping, best mapping in the industry, the best 2D sonar industry in the industry, the best down imaging with Mega Plus now, and the best side imaging, Mega Plus. And then we can throw in 360 amazing sonar that you can use on the front of the boat. Hook it up with the Bluetooth with the talons. You can control your talons, your 360, your Minn Kota Ultrax, iPilot Link, there's no other product on the market that can give you more and allow you to do more than Humminbird Fish Finders. The Solix or the Helix. Check them out. Get you a Mega Plus unit and put it on your boat today. Available in a wide variety of sizes and a wide variety of budgets to fit and suit your needs. It's going to help you enjoy your time more on the water. Get more, do more, and enjoy more. Get you a Humminbird. It's the simplest, easiest unit on the market and it gives you the highest level of data and detail. Thank you for tuning in to another Tips and Tricks from Doug Varnberg. We're going to get out here. We're going to play some more with the new Mega Plus imaging from Humminbird and help you learn more, do more, and get more out of your investment. Enjoy your time and get on the water and there are some fishies down there that are calling my name. I'm getting ready to get the rods out and see what we can catch today. Thank you and tune in next time.